Have a seat, Charles. Uh, my name's Chad. Well, Chad is a derivative of Charles. That's true, uh, but I, my name's not Charles, it's Chad, as it says on my birth certificate. So your parents are assholes. Yep. So do you want to see my reel? No need. I know it's going to be a bunch of short films with stories filled with the awkwardness of, of weird situations. Frankly, I, I don't need to see them. You've got the job. Really? Yeah. I was just looking for someone to set up a light stand and pay minimum wage, but see, I need someone with balls. I like your balls. I need someone who can stick with me. Someone who will get the job done no matter what. Welcome aboard. So, Kat doesn't mind that you use language in front of her? Like English? No, like uh, the C word or the G word. Which G word? Uh, grun... Oh, gruntle. Yeah, that's the one. What about it? Well, it's a strong word. It's strong language. Darfur, Joseph Stalin, the Holocaust. How can words to describe genocide be easier to take than a three-inch portion of skin separating two balls and a butt? No, Cat doesn't mind that word. She's not as stupid as the rest of this naive society. I got balls. He likes balls. <laughs> Do you? <laughs> Ball boy here wants to ask you out. I never said that. I never said that. Why not? He'll meet you at Spat's Cafe at 8. Yes. Yes, I will. So, I'm reading The Sun Also Rises by Hemingway. It's very interesting. Oh. I, I, don't, I don't care for Hemingway. Really? I mean, either. I don't even like the book. In fact, I think it's boring. I'm just afraid to tell anyone in the art world. Well, sometimes the art world can be rather clicky. I know. Tell me about it. Questioning Hemingway is like, artistic suicide. But artists are already suicidal. You shouldn't be afraid of what you do or say. Art, it's just about expressing yourself. You're right. What'd you say? I, I, I said you're right. I can't believe you. After all this time, all this work we put into this relationship, you just want to throw it all away? <laughs> I, I, I want to throw it all away. You had sexual, yes, sexual relations with the doorman. I had to tip him. Maybe if you weren't so damn cheap, I wouldn't have to. Well, did you have to tip the gardener, too? You pay the man less than minimum wage. Our immigration laws are ridiculous. I'm sorry. I believe in amnesty. You bitch! Oh, no. Baby, I, I didn't mean it. You forgot your coat. Come back to me!
That was awesome. Well, you are a struggling filmmaker. And that wasn't a bail for a struggling filmmaker. You didn't have to bring me to that restaurant just to impress me. I guess it's the last time I go to that place. <laughs> so, what does impress you? What's the matter? Instant boner. Now that's impressive. True romantic at last. Are you bouncing? I can't help it. I'm just so happy. Well, knock it off. Okay, yes, sir. Sorry. I need you to go out to my sure house in Jersey. I have a special office in my basement. Pick up the B-roll footage on the crate next to the TV. Don't look at anything else. Don't touch anything else. Okay.